The next morning, the alarm goes off, and um, I pretended NASA was there. It's the stupidest story. I literally went five, four, three, two, one. I counted out loud, and then I stood up. And I, I'll never forget standing there in my bedroom. It was dark. It was cold. It was winter in Boston. And for the first time in three months, I had beaten my habit of hitting the snooze button. There were moments all day long, all day long, just like that five second moment in bed, where I knew knowledge, what I should do. And if I didn't move within five seconds, my brain would step in and talk me out of it. Every human being has a five second window, it might even be shorter for you. You have about a five second window in which you can move from idea to action before your brain kicks into full gear and sabotages any change in behavior. Your life is what you think it should be. That's exactly what you are right now. You are what you thought you should be. And if you don't like who you are, you got to change what you think you should be. What you think is more important than what you do. And so if you want to change, you got to work on this attitude bit. Decide, commit, act, succeed, repeat. The one thing that all the greats have in common is they sweat the small stuff. They pay very, very close attention to every detail. What makes you comfortable can ruin you. And what makes you uncomfortable is the only way to grow. What you are and what you become depends on...